welcome to the Rise reunion where we talk to the winners of the challenge. We ask them a few questions just to get the in the know about them. My name is Courtney Kurzel, one of your hosts, and I am joined by... I'm Natalia Kuboska. Um, really excited to be here today. I did want to talk through a couple quick wins from the Rise Step Challenge. So huge thank you to everyone that participated. We had over 60 participants in the challenge as a whole, and everyone was actively walking each day. Um, we ended the month with over 16 million steps. To be exact, we had 16,102,172 steps across all of our participants, which is huge. And here we are with our first place winner, Zoe, Woo! bringing in at an astounding 747,771 steps. Woo! Woo! And Cody is our second place finisher for the Rise Step Challenge, here to prove if second really is best. Cody did bring in at 521,096 steps for the entire month of May, which is incredible. Like I said, second place here, going to answer a couple of questions for us along the way. I am joined today by our third place um, winner, Hillary, which congratulations, Thank by the you. way, you got third place. You had a total of 498,593 steps across the month of May, which is no small feat. We are dying to know. Um, did your participation in the challenge push you to increase your daily step count? And if so, can you talk about that a little bit? Yeah, it definitely made me increase my step count. I don't normally walk like an average of like over 20k steps a day. <laughs> I found out about this challenge. I'm a very competitive person. Basically what my day to day was for the first half of May was I'd bring my work bag and my gym bag to work. And then I really walk on the treadmill for like an hour and a half, sometimes even two hours at one point. And my calves are very sore throughout the entire month of May, but then I also play pickleball and tennis, and so now that it's nicer outside, I've walked to like tennis courts at Waveland, which is like an hour and a half walk, and I walk back. Sometimes I walk to Grant Park, so that was at least an hour walk, and then I play pickleball. One time I played for like six hours straight, so constantly <laughs> moving my body. So no one can say you didn't earn these steps in this challenge. Yeah, no, <laughs> no way. I think just any type of challenge that I'm in or competition, you just want to, you want to win. And unfortunately, I didn't get 200,000 more steps to win. So, um, yeah, a little tough, but definitely always wanted to step more. So. Yeah, it did. Unfortunately, it had the additional motivation that I'm actually training for a marathon and base training started. So Wonderful. I needed to get out, out yes. there anyway, but it really encouraged me to go a little bit farther, do some mm -hmm. more cool down walks, um, and really just take advantage of the May weather in Chicago. So, um, in addition to the runs, getting out on some additional walks. Amazing, and I know your steps definitely pushed the rest of us to step further as well. Every time I saw you or Cody or Zoe stepping up, I knew I had to get out of bed and just start <laughs> walking or maybe even sprinting to get my own steps up. So, Glad we appreciate the motivation <laughs> and the inspiration. What did you notice from stepping? Was there any impact, whether it's physical or mental? Yeah, physical, definitely my calves are sore, but I, I mean, I was in Japan for half of May, so that's another way of how I got steps because we were walking around all the time. Uh, no, I think it's um, definitely physically just because you get sore when you're stepping that much or running or doing anything physical, um, but also mentally when you're doing a challenge or any type of competition and you're more disciplined and you're mm -hmm. you know, waking up every day and making sure you get steps in, you're walking your dog, you're doing these these things outside in nature and, and fresh air, you, you feel better mentally. It's almost like mini therapy in a way to, to walk that much. Um, so yeah, I think it definitely definitely helps in, in many different ways. Yeah, absolutely. I definitely felt that I was getting stronger, especially in my legs, and even noticed by the end of the month I was getting faster. Oh my goodness. Um, so got some, some PRs in some of my last runs in the last week, which was really encouraging. Did you face any barriers to increasing your daily steps? I know you mentioned you had to go to some great lengths to get there, so can you talk a little bit about that? I was traveling to Japan, I knew I wouldn't get steps because I'd be on like a 13 hour flight. Mm -hmm. So that's why I kind of wanted to push myself earlier in the month of May to account for some of the days I'd have lesser steps. Yeah, so after a while you get sore, so <laughs> the legs definitely cramped out a lot, um, and there's days when you just don't want to get up and walk anymore, um, and there's also days when you look at the leaderboard and you notice that someone's 100,000 steps more than you, yeah. and you think about, well, how can I take her down, or how many steps do I have to get today? Um, <laughs> so, yeah, a lot of things you gotta get. Work was a barrier. Got yeah. my way. <laughs> Definitely got some more um, steps in on the weekends. Um, I also had a few long travel days, so that made it a little bit more difficult to get out, but then also pushed me to go farther in the days that I was around home. 
Awesome. So what I'm hearing is that the next time we have a staff challenge, we should just have the entire month off of work. Yeah. Agreed. So let's take that to the leadership the next time we do one of these and see if we can get that through for everyone that participates. I'm sure we'd actually increase our participation as well. I think so. And lastly, what was your favorite song to get some steps in? Yeah, so I think it became Man Eater by Melanie Furtado. So I went to the movie Challengers, which was a tennis movie. Mm -hmm. And I don't even think that song was in the movie, but it was in her promotions. And so it's an old song, but I, I had that on repeat a lot. It's a classic. Yeah. <laughs> so can we edit in the song Man Eater? To this yes, movie? definitely. Yeah. Is there um, a favorite song you have that really motivated you to keep stepping? Um, uh, I don't know if it's a very work appropriate song, but uh, I like Juice World, so I listen to like Bad Boy by Juice World and Lana Doug. I listen to a lot of Chicago rappers and uh, the likes of like, yeah, Juice World, Polo G, you know, a lot of uh, that type of music. You run out of your love. I hope you know if I said it, baby, I'm in ten. Final question for you, Hillary. What was your favorite song or podcast or thing to do while you were stepping? Yes, so ironically, I feel like I actually listened to less music because I made my husband come with me on the runs mm -hmm. and on my walks. So talk to him a lot. And then also um, when I didn't have him along, I listened to a podcast, um, Road Runner. So I learned some running tips for my marathon training. Amazing, so it not only strengthened your marriage, but it allowed you to educate yourself on marathon training tips. <laughs> Think of all these benefits, people, come on. As our first place winner, you are receiving a hundred dollar value item mm -hmm. from the health and wellness category on Amazon. All right, yeah. cool. So, congratulations! <laughs> Thanks, guys. Price is $75 value oh. to any product on Amazon's health and wellness site. Oh, wow! Awesome. So, that'll keep you, keep you going. I can't wait for the next challenge. We are so proud of you for getting third place. As a result of your third place finish, you are gonna get a $50 gift card toward our health and wellness. So you'll be able to pick a gift from our health and wellness section in Amazon. So congratulations. We're excited to see what happens next for you. Awesome, thank you so much. Lovely yeah, to meet you today. We really appreciate your participation and your constant motivation of everyone else in this step challenge to increase their <laughs> steps and your overall tenacity throughout the entire month of May. Thanks guys. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.